Hi YouTube. Um, I was I was talking to a friend online last night, and he, we were we were talking about um, the blessings of God and how people um, neglect to receive the blessings of God, and even for my own life, uh, God gave me a word specifically. Um, for my own life. Um, now I won't say what the word actually was, but um, I, I, I had I had a, a really hard time believing it, and I think it's because that as Christians, I know for myself, sometimes when the Lord tells you something, tells you that you're blessed, you kind of you kind of believe it, but you kind of don't believe it at the same time. So, I, um, he said, he said in his email, he said, Rachel, do me a favor, he said, take a day, take a day and just, um, claim the blessings of God. And there's, there's a chapter in Deuteronomy, Deuteronomy 28, that has about eight blessings that the Lord promised us. And um, he said, take a day and just quote those blessings. So now I'm, as I was quoting those blessings, as I was reading Deuteronomy 28 this morning and quoting those blessings, something dawned on me. Um, I thought it would be interesting if, if, um, at least for one day a week, I can get people with me quoting those blessings over their life, and let's see things change in our lives, because it's, it's time for the devil to stop running over the church. It's time for us to stop letting him r run roughshod over us. We are the righteousness of God, and we need to take authority over those promises. So what, what I'm, well, I'm calling it the Deuteronomy 28 challenge. What I'm challenging people to do is for one day a week for the month of November, just one day, not every day or whatever, whatever fits you, your schedule, one day or two days a week for the month of November, Go to Deuteronomy 28 and and quote those blessings. Um, now I'm a King King James reader, but you can get it in any Bible. It doesn't matter what version. It doesn't matter. But just as long as you quote the pre uh, the blessings of God, and it starts from verse two and it goes to verse uh, I think six. So. Every one day a week for the month of November, quote those blessings, pray those blessings, receive the blessings of God for your life, and you'll see how things will change. Alright, YouTube, I'll see you later. Bye.